Hi everyone, I'm going to show you some awesome new changes that I know you're going to love. We have modified Doogie Guys to interact directly with Blizzard Quest Objective button that you normally see in your Objective Tracker. Clicking the button will now do five things. One, it will automatically switch the waypoint to the selected quest. Second, it will automatically change the model in the model viewer. And third, the mini blob will also change to reflect the current quest that you selected. The fourth action that we'll do, that it will now update the target button according to the quest that I select. So the target button will always select to whatever is being displayed in the model viewer. With these new changes, the extra features are no longer limited to the current step of the guide and you can use them just by clicking on the Blizzard Quest Objective Tracker. To enable the anchored small frame, go to the settings menu and click on the frame setting and untick floating small frame to enable it. This will merge the small frame into the Blizzard Quest Objective Tracker. In this mode, the border will expand vertically rather than horizontally and you will be able to hide the small frame by clicking the collapse button. This mode is ideal for users who don't like our original small frame that expand horizontally and it will provide you with more control of the objective frame allowing you to move it anywhere on your screen and it will also add a border around the objective frame. You should allow Doogie Guys to automatically add and remove quests for you but you can also add your own quests and it will automatically expand and resize for you. Everything else would work the same as I explained earlier. Clicking the objective button would automatically change your waypoint, change your model, change your mini blob and your target button. And if you don't like having the border around your objective frame, you can easily hide the border by going to the border section and untick small frame border. Alright, that's it for this video. There is a fifth feature that will activate when you click on these buttons, which is the map preview feature, so make sure you watch that video as well. This is Doogie signing out and thank you for watching.